it's been a minute and I owe you an update. Oh, where to start? Where to start? It has been, it has been just two weeks, but it feels like an eternity. It feels like an eternity. I want to start today by congratulating Team Shrinkables on a third place win this week with Derek's Journey Step Challenge. If you're new to my channel, I'm participating in the Step Challenge this month. I'm a team captain of Team Shrinkables. And yeah, I'm so proud of my team for coming into third place. If you're not familiar with the Step Challenge, I encourage you to check out Derek's journey his channel be linked below there's going to be great challenges that you'll be able to join in the future if you missed out on this one so you should go ahead and check out his channel and subscribe also as part of the steps challenge i am doing a side challenge which is a scavenger hunt and it's put on by my friend cheryl davis who also has a youtube channel her channel will be linked below but each week she puts out, you know, some items for us to look for and take photos of and we can post. And you can find my my pictures that I post on Instagram at Deanna's Adventure. So if you want to follow along with the scavenger hunt portion, go ahead and do that. You can find my pictures um, again on my Instagram with Deanna's Adventure. And also you can do a search, search for hashtag happy searching oh i hope i got that right hashtag happy searching and you'll be able to see other people's entries for the scavenger hunt and it's just a fun way a little something fun for us to do while we're out getting our exercise in getting our steps in a nice little distraction and it's fun and it's so nice to see the other photos i really like seeing what other people come up with and what they see and it's just fun and it brings you know some joy to me that's the steps challenge. I am hoping that for week two, we won't know the results for a couple of days, but I'm hoping that my team can, you know, maintain their third place or get to that second place or maybe even first place. That would be so amazing. Let's see what we can do. So this is a weight loss channel. Hi, welcome. If you're new here, I'm Deanna. I'm on an adventure to lose over a hundred pounds and this is my weekly weigh-in video. I didn't even weigh in last week, guys. I went on a cruise and between, you know, packing and laundry and getting all the things sorted out, I just ran out of time and wasn't able to do a video last week for my weigh-in. So last week, let's um, pull it up here on the handy dandy phone, you know, where we keep all of our nice weigh-ins because I can't remember anything. I am like, Whew, I, my brain is not working. So let's see. May 27th, I weighed in at 211.8. And then I had an absolutely terrible week leading up to my cruise. A terrible week leading up to my cruise. Last week on 6-1, was it? Yep, I weighed in at, this is terrible guys, 215.2. So before I'm even heading out to my cruise, I'm already with a gain of three and a half pounds before I even left for my cruise, before I even left. So I was dealing with a lot of thoughts about, you know, just who cares? Just go on your cruise, have a good time. You can worry about anything whenever you get back. You know, just total effort mentality. Mindset is a lot of the game. Mindset is so much. It helps you, you know, if you're in the right mindset, you're willing to get that exercise in, you're more willing to eat right, you're more willing to track things. If you track things, all of it, it all works in conjunction with each other and when your mindset's off everything else can be off too so that mindset and I was really having to have a lot of conversations with myself regarding this you know effort mentality that I was having where I was just thinking that you know what's the whole point it's not even worth it one week doesn't matter like all of these negative thoughts were coming into my head and I just kept trying to combat that 
and it went on all entire week the whole time that I was gone on the cruise it was it was going on the whole entire time I had to keep having conversations with myself about this so before I get to that let me just you know let you know that number one I didn't vlog on this cruise it was just you know a vacation with me and my husband for us to enjoy and I really didn't want to have to be responsible for making sure that I was vlogging and telling a story and all of those things so I'm just gonna put in a few little you know highlights and snippets but it's not gonna be much here you go let's check out the cruise <laughs> We're on the ship! We made it! Beat 
short and sweet. It was a nice little short little cruise. Totally enjoyed it. And then I came back just in time for my weigh-in day because I always weigh in on Fridays. So I returned last night, got to the house about midnight, got up this morning and I weighed in. So last week, if you're following along, I was 215.2. And this week, oh my gosh, let me tell you guys, we had the drink package. So that means unlimited drinks, whatever you want, coffee, milkshakes, alcoholic drinks, soda, whatever you want, all inclusive. You don't have to pay any extra. Cruise ships, you know, if you've ever known, it's an all inclusive food thing. So you can just eat all day, every day. And yeah, you can, you know, do a lot. So when I stepped on the scale this morning, it said, 218 pounds so I gained 2.8 pounds from 6-1 so there you have it that's my weigh-in it was vacation it is what it is I'm more upset about the week before vacation than I am about the actual gain on vacation I don't even know what happened the week before vacation. I know that we didn't have a solid meal plan in place. We were kind of eating through the pantry and whatever was left over in the fridge because we didn't want to buy new groceries that were going to go bad or we're going to have to throw out while we're on vacation. So that could have been, you know, part of it. Who knows? But the thing is, is it is what it is. And we just pick ourselves up and we move forward. So here we it is. We're officially pressing that restart button, reset button, whatever you want to call it, button. We just get back to regular life. So today it is back to my routine. It is back to my schedule. It's back to getting my 10,000 steps of water a day. 10,000. It is back to getting my 10,000 steps a day, drinking my gallon of water every day, eating whenever I'm hungry, stopping whenever I'm satisfied making sure that I'm getting quality sleep, at least seven hours of sleep every single night. It's back to the basics. And, you know, there's no reason to delay getting started. We're gonna get started today and we're gonna do this and we're gonna see what we can do. And I hope to hopefully lose those first three pounds this week. We'll see, hopefully it's like water weight, you know, travel weight. I don't know, we'll see. The scale could even still go up more. I just got back yesterday. Yesterday, I had like all the things. We went to New Orleans, we had hurricanes and food galore and all the stuff. So yeah, we're gonna have to wait and see. Anyway, it's just been a chatty little vlog. I just wanted to update you guys today to give you a quick, you know, weigh in. Where have I been? How is Team Shrinkables doing? I managed to do all that. If you stayed this long, oh my God, I didn't even tell you guys. I celebrated my birthday while I was gone. So it was also my birthday. So if you made it this long, comment down below. Happy belated birthday. I'll see you guys in the next video. As always, it's gonna be an adventure.